everybody. Thanks for watching Car Inside. We're getting ready to run the Xfinity Series Be Fixed here at Watkins Glen. Probably our favorite road course. Seems to be the most popular road course for all the NASCAR fans and the guys that run the NASCAR Series. I definitely enjoy it. Um, hey Nathan, I've watched a couple of your videos this week. I hope it helps. Yeah, me too. I've not run a lap here yet, so we're about to see how it goes. John's pretty, he's a lot better than I am here, so that's why I had him do it. But I appreciate the support, man. Line up behind the safe guard. Yeah, so John's a lot better road racer than me. John done a breakdown for a qualifying lap here at uh, Watkins Glen for the Xfinity cars. So if you're watching this video looking to learn, I'm probably going to learn a lot more than from him than what you will me. So uh, head over, check that out, see what he's doing. But nonetheless, we're number one here in this split. With uh, We got lucky um, to be the number one car, I, I guess. I don't know. We might get showed up and look bad as the number one. But we got a 1200 I rating on road. Not very good road racer. So we did. We're fortunate. Got the pole. So we'll go out here, try to do what we can, make the most of it, and uh, hopefully have a fun race. John had somebody in here that... Uh, Said they watched your lap and appreciated it. Hey, hell yeah, Line that's cool. The pace car. Be on the ball, man. I do think this is my first ever pace pole on a road course. Overdrove it. All clear. I was in a full four tire slide all the way through one and two. <laughs> I saw the whole thing, that was impressive. I feel like I've got better speed, I just can't put a lap together. One minute 16.26. Good, do it good. Don't get caught in his trap. That damn Grant Thompson, he can though.
We're starting qualifying night, so. Yeah, miss it. I'll be back. Made a big mistake there. I need a two. I want it way really wide on my second lap in turn one, and you now I'm going to be starting the night. Dang. How many people did you get in there? I don't think there's six or seven of us. I'll be honest, I don't mind starting from the back. Right, kind of help you learn. Feel the dirty John, air. You want to go over there to the Venom chat? Oh, that's where I just was. <laughs> oh, okay. No I came back. Uh, I fucked up qualifying really bad. Yeah, I did too. Uh, my first lap, I was just trying to put a lap down, get the tire seat up. Second lap, I was going to send it, and I went way too wide in turns one and two. Yeah, I don't like this place very much. It's, it's weird. It's just a weird shape, and it's the corners don't match, and it, I don't know. It's, it's different. It's a pain in the ass. Nathan, are you recording? I am. Oh, hello, car inside people. Me and Garrett are talking about Myrtle Beach. Still there. One minute fifteen point eight eight seven. Three. In the trucks. In the trucks. There is no setup for that, by the way. Yeah, they're using the hickory setup. Which don't make sense at all because those two tracks are nothing alike. It has to be the gearing and stuff. Well, IRP is more like Myrtle Beach, and we changed the gearing to fit Myrtle Beach, but it was so break loose on corner entry you couldn't hold it. I mean, every third lap, everybody was spinning. Wow. RP fixed was not as bad, but it's what this game is. So for all you people listening, that's Garrett's advice on setups. <laughs> I don't know shit about them. I just go through them all until something sticks. Oh my gosh, that's a new slogan. We're going to do Garrett's setup shops. I don't know anything about them, but we go through them until something sticks. <laughs> 
That's perfect. This week we're gonna be running. Zittle is a savage. Nope. I love I love Zittle. But the qualified on pole if you didn't if you wanted the EOL. What was it? Homie oh, wanted an EOL after qualifying on the pole. Zittle told him no. And then said he shouldn't have been so fast. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Man, I wish I didn't make that mistake. What happened? I just overdrove the bus stop and lost about a second to the leader. But when do you guys go for tires? You can go all the way. Oh, we have fast repairs. Why, is it all? I'm not stopping. I'm trying to figure out why this homie in the Rackley truck up here is all over the place. I'm, I think him and the dude on Polar are friends. He hits me and I'm going to put him in the wall because I really don't care about this practice race. What was that? What the hell, man? I only jumped the start and low on everybody. He was beneath me when we crossed the start finish line. Well, I guess an off track for what just happened isn't the worst thing. And somehow we didn't lose any ground to the leaders, so... Wow. Somebody wrecked. Yeah, go by. I know I'm holding you up. He put me in quite a spot myself. He pulls some stupid stuff like that again, I'm spinning him. Down to the bottom, making hit the. Hit That's the what I did. He spun me out. You know what I'm saying I'm gonna push him all the way down to the dang pit wall. He's uh, gonna hit it nose first. I'll be right back. He does that same thing again.
See you later, dumb fuck. What did he do? I don't know, but he's gone. I don't care. <laughs> he he wrecked and got me again. I told Ziddle he I was gonna punt him. I didn't get a chance to punt him because he got loose. I I don't know. He probably just drove down into me. If that's who I think it is, he's. The dude that Brendan wrecked in our uh, NIS race that I won. That makes sense. We're gonna get them all. Come on, Bob. What happened to the leader? I better not go lap down for taking tires. He gave me a well on lap eight. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. This is a shit show. Did you get got again? No, I'm good. Oh, okay. This Grant Thompson dude spun out some other Yeah, game. that's the dude that's been leading every lap. My voice too. My voice chats. Uh, can't even say nothing. Nathan. Running second, I'll run this guy down and then make a mistake and go gain on me and I'll run him down and lap car will get in the way. Don't I've make went, mistakes, dummy. I know. I've went from four seconds to two seconds about three times now. 
I'm fine with P2. Sure, complaining a lot to be fine with P2. <laughs> Oh, I wonder if that'll help. My wheel was set at like 10. Yeah, good race, Chris. You got your eyes full there. There's a lot going on in front of you. Good win, James. I got a half a second from him. God, but. bless America. Wow, that was uh, that was interesting. 94, 91, 91, 86. That last lap was crazy. We uh, we shouldn't even been in his realm there on that last lap. Lap car just about cost him, but it's part of it. Got to make the most of it. What just happened? Uh, Rutherford hit the wall coming out of turn four and took out everybody. Got P2, made some mistakes. Let's go back and see that one where the car was parked. There it is. I got to watching him and miss my breaking point. Well, if we didn't have fast bears, I'd be out here running by myself. Damn near. What happened? Here's the leader's view. Oh my gosh! Yeah, that was uh, that was scary, to say the least. Then we made a mistake and drove through the grass twice coming out of the bus stop. That's usually the best part of the track for us uh, in uh, previous weeks uh, or previous seasons, rather. So, gotta make improvements there. It's uh, odd that that's where I seem to be struggling at is uh, getting through the final corner there. Probably need to drag the brake a little longer. I'll go back and watch it. But we uh, take P2, got the pole, first ever pole on a road race, and then come away here second in the first race of the week can't really complain too much about that so as always thank you guys for watching car inside and we'll see y'all next time